Να δω πως όλοι αυτοί οι τραπεζίτες μαζεμένοι δεν θα πούμε τα ίδια πράγματα σήμερα. With all these bankers, with all these bankers on the panel, most likely we won't say the same things, I think. <laughs> That's my understanding. It is quite important in order to identify the dynamics, uh, to check the backdrop, the financial, the macroeconomic backdrop, in order to review these dynamics. We know that we used to have a growth rate of 7.7%, uh, 8% in Q1. So growth is significant, in average more than 5%. That's great. What is encouraging, and Yanis commented on it, is that in the past, this kind of growth used to be uh, consumption driven. This has changed significantly. Currently, we have an increase of fixed uh, investments, approximately 60%, an increase of exports, and uh, Yanis said something about tourism. The figure is tremendous. We're talking about a 47% rise when talking about uh, in terms of uh, exports of services. And this is mainly uh, driven by tourism. All these great achievements, of course, have been uh, uh, have been have given a boost for lendings. Check the NBG figures in the first semester. Uh, the loan balances before forecast was approximately 148 billion euros. We're talking about 2.5 percent more than last year. So, how do we do that, and why can we do it? Okay, we have robust economy. Uh, of course, as uh, said something about that, we do have the capital, we have uh, deposits coming back, we have a very friendly monetary policy that helps uh, cash flows, and to a great extent, we have solved the NPL issue. Why is this important? Why is it important that NPLs are out of uh, out of the table? If you check what bankers used to do in the past two years and what we do now, you will understand. We used to spend lots of our time in order to discuss about uh, red loans. We used, we, we used to spend much time on that. Imagine one, um, one uh, red loan in order to put it in order, it would take great amount of time in order to have some uh, uh, some kind of result. What changed everything also was technology. One of the good things that, okay, not many things, but one of the good things that came as a result of the uh, COVID pandemic was that the use of technology and technology itself skyrocketed. So now we have uh, someone uh, who works in a branch and he used to just do transactional stuff. Now nobody deals with them. Everything takes place online. So we do have the time to we have the time to spend with uh, the customer and do some added value uh, things with them. I'm saying that uh, because okay, things used to be good until today. We don't know what will happen in the future. I'm not saying that everything is uh, rosy, but we are Falling should everything, um, the energy prices, the money costs, uh, the inflation. We are here in order to make sure that our customers are doing fine. And that's what we will keep on doing. We used to do that in the past and we will do it in the future as well.